Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the Jordan Tractor Vlog videos. We're actually up here in uh, Burnett Corners, Wisconsin, which is located by Beaver Dam, about ten, uh, five miles uh, west. Uh, we are at the Dodge County Entry Tractor Show here, and I wanted to kind of walk around some of this place here and show you guys what they have to offer. So come with me and we'll show you what you got to offer here today. So this is the 50 some annual Burnett Corners Dodge County Tractor Show. Uh, we have some wheel horse tractors over here. We have some home lights over there. Uh, John Deere. Over here we got some hit and misses running. Gentleman is working on one currently. These are water pump machines. They uh, shoot water out. Go ahead and uh, walk on down this way and see what else we got. That's John Deere hit miss engines here. Home white garden tractors down the road here. We also have a Minneapolis Moline 110. We also have some very nice John Deere patio garden tractors here. This is the red model. made only in 1970. This is the orange one. This one's a 120. This is a blue 1970 John Deere Patio 112. the 71 patio yellow edition okay. John Deere one bottom wow and in a 63 John Deere 110 round fender with a wagon have quite a big collection here of uh, McCullough chainsaws a couple of these I have in my collection at home on the shelf All, uh, uh, trackers. Bigger engines here running. Miss engine run. This one here, the 1907. Another one.
V8 lawnmower. Bourbon bottle there for our radiator catch. Got some massive turbo diesel here. Massive Super 12. Not massive 12. Oh, some gorgeous Alice Homesteader there next to us. Gorgeous simplicity. Cutaway engines here. Shows the internals of how the engine would work. And this is another flathead brakes cutaway. That's a John Deere 140. Really nicely done up. Chalmers or Alice Chalmers, John Deere on style. More line of uh, hit and miss engines here. Kind of going the line here and show you guys what we got. This is a fan on top front of this one. Kind of dirty. A Galloway, we got a Water Boy, a John Deere, a Model Z, and a Nick Hyman. Gorgeous John Deere here. Stunning paint job on both of these here. What else? Alice Farmall AV. Oh, I keep saying Alice. Pardon me there. And we got a Farmall 504. All restored. Got a Cub Cadet 982. Cub Cadet International ROM Fender. These were made like 62 or 63, I believe. Oh boy. And a couple of boys. Next to a Ferguson diesel. These were a Ford tractor, but this was made by Ferguson. Which is still a Ford, just with Ferguson's name on it. Really cool, thought out tractors. And I got Farmall Super Amp. We got us a trike here, a V8 trike. Got us a Oliver 1950. A Ford 8 in with a V8 engine. And a farm all with a, another, so I believe is a Cummins engine in this one. little John Deere 40 there. Corn shellers here, selling some corn, grinding them up. Doing a fine job at it. A 
this one's a hand crank we done. Minneapolis Moline Town and Country 110. It has a hydraulic lift on it. Cub Cadets here. AMF hydrostatic. Case articulator. This tractor here kind of inspired me to build my own a little bit. Massive Ferguson with a loader on it. And John Deere 110 around front with a loader. And then Cockshot 50. have one of these in our garage, thought a mower deck fit. It's gonna be restored for a Lexus. It's a bigger model. It's got customized Bowens here, two trim. Another Bowen 56. Ten fifty and a twelve fifty four. Good looking. Ten fifty there. And here we have some of my lineup and some of my friends, and we'll walk the rest of the way down here. That's my wheel horse articulator that I built. And my Kermit Ward that I'm still cautiously finishing. My eight fifty six wheel horse. The uh, GT14. Okay. Lawn Ranger. Rest in peace, George.
20s here, like what I picked up. Pretty busy here today at the Dodge County. Quite a few people um, showing different things from hitness engines to corn trailers to farm tractors to we have a vintage car show, sawmills, blacksmith shops, um, steamers here, all sorts of good stuff. So, kind of give you guys a little bit more of these hitness engines here, and we're going to head over to the car show and we'll show you what's over there. Unit here is filling the bags up with corn. Throw them on in there and they come out over here. King there, John Deere 620, and John Deere 810. Just a little bit more of the tractors that we have up here. The V10 Atlas, John Deere 12, the V110. Already got a lot more there. Yeah. Ah, here it's breezy and cool. And even if you come to Dodge County Tractor Show, you either can choose to ride a horse, a miniature horse here. Up the other side over here, you can go ride a camel. Chevy here. The International 
go. Old Chevy Dooley here. Go ahead and point on her there. F-250 Custom. Sweet looking pickup truck here. All done up. Time to play toolbox. Here we have a another Chevy here. Just all done up. Forty eight Dodge, four door sedan. Old and Bill. Chevy truck here. truck see the bigger here got a Mac diesel green truck have a, uh, Peterbilt cab over here that we also have another one Tricked out both of these trucks are really nice, good shape, polished up, fully restored trucks. Old school. A Chevy wagon here. Chevy here. Quiet. Come here. <laughs> I have a mash metropolitan. <laughs> Alright guys, we're already at a 24 minute video. Um, there's some, a couple other things I'm going to walk around and take some videos of the old case farm tractors here and glance you at the swap meet and we'll show you the steamers and that's kind of the little run down a dodge county antique power tractor show here so check this video out be sure to check out all my other videos and i will see you guys in the next jordan's tractor block videos thanks for watching